Yo, what's going on? Ajax here, coming back with another video today. Moment we've all been waiting for. Finally, Valorant already coming out with ranked. So today we're going to be talking about that. Be sure if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a like. Check out my channel, subscribe, go follow me on Twitter. Check out my Twitch, all that. Let's get straight into the video. So yes, Valorant is in closed beta and already has a ranking system come out. I think Riot's doing a really good job with this game. They're really listening to the community, seeing what we want. That's Riot, they got League of Legends. They killed it with that. I'm sure you're going to do the same with this game, so I'm very excited. So first off, let's let's take a look at let's take a look at the ranks. So looking at the ranks here, we got eight different tiers and Within those eight different tiers, there's 22 different ranks. So for the eight tiers, we got Mercenary, Soldier, Veteran, Hero, Legend, Mythic, Immortal, and the final one, the top, the top of the top, Valorant. So Mercenary, Soldier, Veteran, that's, that's just kind of like your average player, like Silver Bronze from other games. And you got your Hero, Legend, and Mythic. These are the... Like above average maybe some streamers you know like the guys that play the game a lot all day and you got immortal and valorant this is where your pros are going to be living this is the the top of the ranking system so what we know about ranked is there will be placement matches i mean that's just how it is in every game i mean those placement matches you play them figures out your skill and it puts you in a rank pretty basic so now from what i've heard and just based off of what riot has said the way the ranking system will work is it'll focus on your individual skill but it also takes into consideration if you get the win or the loss so that way it focuses more on um like the team play aspect of it and it's not just all about the individual right was talking about a, like a draft system so they could like four matches you could ban heroes or certain maps you could pick them and uh and with this, they were also hoping to add a more team aspect factor to the game. I think Riot really is headed in that direction with Valorant focusing more on the team aspect of it, just getting the W, not, not individual effort. Another thing Riot has talked about with this is um, like queues. Like if you play with like a like a five man queue, odds are you're probably going to be playing against another five man queue, or if it's with two you mean you'll have another two like they're just trying to make the games as even as possible so now for the part we don't know about rank we don't know if like how long the rank season is going to last we, we don't know if it's going to be like a year that's split into th three parts you have to play your placement matches three times a year we know there's going to be a battle pass but is that going to have effect on the, the ranking system like so that's what we're still waiting to see from Riot. But it's out. It's in Valorant. So today I'm definitely going to be playing some Valorant. Maybe streaming it. So if you want to go check out the stream, link will be in the description. Same with my Twitter. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Thanks. Have a great day. See ya.